Hey toy fans, I'm D21 Beast and welcome back to my figure review series here on my YouTube channel. And it has been a little while guys since you've seen me on this channel and the reason for that as I mentioned in my vlog and even on Project Geek Week is I'm in the middle of a move. So while I was out across the country scouting out my new home, I actually stopped by every toy store on the way, if you can believe it. And I actually stopped by a Target in Ohio and Target had this sort of blind box that I'd never really seen before from the Fairfield Company. It says on the outside that it's 13 collectible minifigures. But if you look at the side of the packaging here, it appears to be that they've just put together a bunch of minifigure toys that previously existed in what appears to be a trading card collector box, which is kind of weird. And then I guess it's just been cellophane wrapped and labeled as its own individual thing. So um, I do like mystery blind boxes and I've never really seen this before. I thought it was pretty cool and definitely wanted to check it out. But the real thing that sold me on this box is when you turn it on the side here, it looks like it's old enough that we might actually get some Fantastic Four and some X-Men love. So I'm really excited about that. I hope whatever I get out of this box, it's all Fantastic Four and all X-Men, and maybe we avoid some of the guys that are getting a little bit of overexposure right now, like Thor, Iron Man, Captain America, pretty much anybody in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So I really have no idea what to accept or expect from this box set, guys, so let's just get things started by getting it cut open. So I've got some scissors here. Let's see if I need that to get into this plastic. All right, here, we're just going to go ahead and pull this off. Again, this is from the Fairfield Company, so I don't know if everything in this packaging is from Fairfield or not, but we'll see what we've got. Go ahead and pull this off and stick it off to the side and yes it does appear to be a trading card box set and looks like we've got a bunch of inserts in here so let's go ahead and pull out the first one i'm going to save the uh x-men fantastic four ones for the end here uh the first one we've got here it's kind of tightly packed in there well let's just pull this one out what do we have here this appears to be some sort of toy surprise looks like we have uh little figures um uh, some sort of lights um what is this a pin Okay, here we go. On the back, it actually tells us everything we've got available. Looks like we can get Cyclops or Green Goblin, Hulk, Iron Man, Spider-Man, Storm, a good range of characters here. Um, you know, I don't know if I really want a light or a pin. Let's hope we get one of those minifigures. Let's go ahead and cut this open here. And let's see here. Just cut it open. What do we have inside? We've got some sort of insert. All right. Uh, just the same thing we saw on the back of the package. And, oh, okay. Well, you know what? I'll take a pin if I get a Wolverine. That's pretty cool. And, yeah, that, that's a pin, all right. <laughs> all right, well, I think we're off to a good start. Let's see how many more X-Men and Fantastic Four things we can get out of this box here. All right, so the next package we have appears to be some sort of toy line for the first Avengers movie. On the back, yep, there we go. Looks like we got everybody who was in the first Avenger film here. Agent Coulson, Black Widow... Looks like Bruce Banner, the Hulk, Hawkeye, Captain America, Iron Man, Loki, Nick Fury. We've got a uh, Tony Stark with his shades on. Thor, and then I guess that's civilian Captain America. Let's see here. We do have a tear strip on this one, so let's go ahead and pull it down and see what we have inside. Just kind of dump them out. Oh, here we go. Got three, two of them dropping. Out. Oh, well, hey, check it out, guys. I basically got the, uh, the Shield B team, which is pretty cool. We've got Coulson and Black Widow and Hawkeye. And Hawkeye's got his one eye open there. That's kind of funny. Uh, looks like they're a little difficult to stand here. Well, let's see here, Coulson. Well, that's pretty quiet. I think I like the Coulson one the best of these three. Give you a better look at Hawkeye. So this is pretty fun already, I guess. Uh, Black Widow. All right, well, let's go and see what we have in that next package here. If we can just get these guys set over here. We have another one from the Avengers movie. Same set of figures. Doesn't appear to be a different wave. We'll just double check. Yeah, those are all the same. Well, hopefully we don't get any doubles here. What do we got? I think I'd like to get... Oh, probably Hulk, I think, of all the ones on here. So let's see if we can get a Hulk. Dump them out. Oh, I did get doubles. Let's see here. I got another Black Widow. Uh, looks like we've got the Bruce Banner and Captain America. <laughs> oh, he's got his fist raised in the air there. All right, well, that's a pretty interesting little set of figures here. Let's see if the other bags in here are from the same toy line. What's this one here? So here we've got Marvel Heroes, and as I already said, Wolverine thing. So this was definitely made before Marvel decided to blackball X-Men and Fantastic Four characters. Oh, nice selection of guys on the back here. We've got Cyclops, Daredevil, Doctor Doom, Human Torch, Invisible Girl, Juggernaut, Fantastic Four, Punisher, Spider-Man, Storm, Thing, and Wolverine. Well, I gotta say, I'm probably most after the Juggernaut figure, although I wouldn't mind a Daredevil either. Uh, let's see what we have here. Let's tear it open. Um, oh, okay, so we got an insert. Um, looks like we've got a Daredevil. Is that a sticker? Yes, it is a sticker. Okay. Well, I wonder if that spoils what's in the bag here. Let's go ahead and dump it out. All right. Looks like we got Spider-Man and we got... 
Um, some weird deformed, what is that? Oh no, that's supposed to be Cyclops. Oh, okay, that is Cyclops. It's just his head isn't glued on. Okay. <laughs> well, I got Cyclops. Awesome. And Spider-Man. And what was the other one we have here? Oh, I got the Punisher. All right. Well, I haven't gotten a Juggernaut yet. Maybe we'll get that in the next bag here. But these guys are actually pretty cool. And it looks like they're in a different sort of scale from the Avengers figures I've already opened. So I guess these are two completely different toy lines. Well, let's go ahead and open that last bag. Uh, let's see here. Terror Strip. All right, we're going to pull that off. And we have another sticker. Looks like we got Storm. Well, that's pretty cool. All right, and on the back of this, it just says Storm. Let's set those to the side here, and let's see what else we have in here. All right, all right. I got Juggernaut. This is an entire, this box is a success, I gotta say. Spider-Man, Mr. Fantastic. I like that he's got his little wiggly arm coming up here. That's pretty cool. But the Juggernaut figure looks honestly completely terrible, but I love that I got the Juggernaut. So a big win for me with this box set. Let's go ahead and get some things cleaned up here. All right, toy fans, so here we've got them all on display for you. We've got the Marvel Mystery Minis there on the left. We've got the Wolverine pin in the center, and then the Avengers-based minifigures on the right. Now, each of these little minifigures stand just over an inch tall. The Wolverine pin is more like three and a half to four inches. And, of course, we have those two stickers that came with the Marvel Mini Heroes as well. I really actually like the stickers. It was a nice inclusion. wasn't expecting that. And I'm glad that I got the Juggernaut minifigure, but, you know, this is a set that's probably a pass maybe if you're not a huge fan of minifigures. Um, it was fun for me to open this up and again I found this at a Target store so I don't know if you're going to find this at other retailers but it was certainly an interesting experiment I think to buy one of these and just kind of check out what was inside. Well thanks for watching this video guys I hope you enjoyed it. If you like what you saw here please feel free to rate, share, subscribe. Also be sure to look me up on Instagram at d21beast. I post a lot of pictures of the toys I review and even some behind the scenes shots so definitely check it out. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.